hi uh, welcome to uh, my youtube channel uh, first time i'm appearing on uh, as a live on my channel so this is basically uh, i'm getting lot of queries and doubts uh, you know regarding the type of the material we are using the plan and the pricing the scope of the work then uh time duration uh, the service availability so different types of uh, queries i am getting every time and those queries are uh, repeatedly uh, you know uh, all of them have uh, the same faqs so i thought uh, we'll start one uh, online session where i can explain them what is uh, the type of the construction we are doing and some general frequent uh, faqs uh, to address uh, what all the queries are there so i just wanted to start that and i took the initiative and i've started that so uh, let me introduce myself i am mohammad um, shakir hussain and i am the uh, ceo and co-founder of the website uh, simplyprefab.com and our company name is the prefabulous homes llp so we have started this website uh, a few months back earlier we were doing uh, on an unorganized in an unorganized manner uh, from the last 15 to uh, 16 uh, years and uh, you know we thought of uh, doing something organized uh, because a lot of people are having similar kind of requirements uh, because of that i thought of starting a website and company so currently we are operating in uh, hyderabad which is telangana and andhra pradesh uh, bangalore chennai uh, we are operating and we have got a couple of queries from uh, uh, Punjab is there, Rajasthan is there, then Delhi and uh, multiple locations, Assam, Northeast. So huge uh, queries are coming and uh, everyone is in requirement of this kind of uh, solution. So, so let me tell you how this scope of work uh, will work and how we'll decide the uh, uh, what I mean to say pricing and all so initially uh, let me explain you the concept so we will use the mild steel uh, construction like we'll use the steel columns steel all mild steel will use uh, you have two, two types of steels mild steel and cold steel so cold steel is generally used in the uh, LGSF uh, this thing light gauge steel framing and mild steel is used widely because of its uh, uh, sir, see that's what I'm telling uh, Nurullah Palgiri, 25 by 30 house G plus 1, I'll come to that pricing. So I'm explaining the procedure first, how, what type of technology will use it uh, and how uh, it will impact the stability and all the details I'll tell you. So simply cost of 25 by 30, uh, I cannot give the pricing for that. So I need a plan so that I, I can give you a plan specific pricing. So for steel construction along with the, uh, uh, so steel, con steel construction along with the internal external walls as uh, we'll use the Birla Aerocon uh, three inch external walls and internal three inch and two inch uh, slab we will use it. Uh, and the rest of the things like the plumbing and uh, electrical will do the concealed uh, plumbing and concealed electrical wiring wherever it is possible and how the general rcc construction will happen the rest of the things are same so steel uh, quantity is decided by the plan uh, which will be shared by you or uh, you you can send a rough sketch uh, so that we can assess how much uh, steel we can we are going to use it the steel basically depends on the span or the plan it's a plan specific so whether it's a g or g plus one or penthouse farmhouse residential commercial or industrial whatever it is there so the steel will be assessed my based on my experience with my fabricators and if the uh, design is a complicated one we will use the uh, structural drawing in detail structural drawing will be used and will be provided the uh, steel quantity so steel will take the per kg pricing uh, then uh, panels and other uh, things we will give the per square feet pricing and uh, false ceiling will be given the per square feet pricing 
then putty painting per square feet pricing doors unit wise windows uh, per square feet wise uh, then tiles per square feet wise um, then uh, uh, what else we have uh, then electrical sometimes will give the lump sum pricing and also plumbing also sometimes will give the uh, lump sum pricing so now the brand which we will use for the steel is the apollo steel or similar brand we will use it if it is a box pipe uh, if it is uh, something you know uh, i beams and i columns are there something like isi mark uh, the material we will use it or we can use the brand materials like the uh, sail or vizac steel uh, but the costing will be different uh, 10 to 15 rupees uh, will be more uh, on that so this is the steel and when it comes to the uh, what we say uh, the panels and all we will use the Birla Eurocon wall panels only and uh, we will not use any other brand based on the client's requirement we'll use if the client is insisting otherwise we'll go with the Birla Eurocon uh, wall panels because of its QC so the steel is uh, mild steel is Apollo and the wall panels are Birla Eurocon wall panels now coming to the roof part uh, so roofing you have multiple options like uh, you know for the roofing we have uh, uh, two inch slab we have uh, then we have three inch slab and 18 mm fiber cement board is there and 0 0.4 mm or 0 0.5 mm uh, fibers uh, color coated sheets are there then you have puff panel also so different types of roofings you can select it based on the application based on the pricing and the feasibility so of all these uh, cheapest one is the or affordable one is the 0.4 mm uh, 0.4 mm sheet which uh, you know which is very uh, you know affordable like 70 rupees or uh, 80 rupees per safety depending upon the brand uh, then the disadvantage with this kind of sheets is uh, the sheets are not uh, you know heat resistant uh, they are uh, prone to the water leakage because of the screws uh, and also you know the sounds during the rain also it will um, uh, make noise uh, during the uh, rain this thing so it's affordable cheap we can say uh, but uh, features wise it is not advisable uh, if somebody has not having the budget we can go for the steel framing with the 0.4 mm and the 2 inch or 3 inch walls with the uh, Birla Eurocon uh, this thing we can go and next coming is this uh, uh, next affordable pricing uh, roofing is for the 18 mm fiber cement board which will cost around 90 to 100 rupees depending upon the location then 2 inch slab will cost around 110 rupees plus waterproofing 3 inch will cost 140 rupees plus waterproofing so puff panel will cost around 170 to uh, 190 rupees if it is a 50 mm if it is a 30 mm will cost around 140 to uh, 150 rupees uh, per square feet so this is the roofing part now coming to the electrical this thing we have a very experienced electrical person who is having 20 plus years of experience so electrical wires we will use the phenolex wires and steel boxes will use it uh, then pvc pipes we will use it for the wiring and uh, for the uh, boxes and the switches we will use uh, maru or gold medal or uh, Ligrand, you have Ligrand also, you have uh, different types of uh, um, uh, brands in that economy is there, medium is there and premium. So we'll use uh, that in the electrical this thing and the electrical points uh, will be uh, suitable electrical points we will be giving based on the client's requirement. Next coming to the fall ceiling, either we will give the gypsum fall ceiling or the PVC fall ceiling will give. Uh, so PVC designs will be the plain design and the PVC stock or the uh, color code or design will be selected by the client we will give them the option and uh, we will do the PVC uh, ceiling just to avoid uh, the uh, putty painting and sanding and painting uh, and uh, the PVC nowadays also uh, looking will look aesthetic wise uh, very good uh, 
uh, that is in the PVC ceiling part. Then next come the uh, doors. Doors uh, generally I advise the client you know, for using the door frames as WPC door frames with four inch thickness and uh, door uh, will be of the um, engineered wood laminate uh, machine laminate we call it as flush doors we'll provide a catalog and the client can select it from that uh, so windows we will give the uh, kinbon profile uh, upvc windows 2.5 track 81 series or 88 series uh, with the cool glass or plain glass whatever the glass they prefer which can be customizable and with mesh it will come Next, uh, tiles generally we'll use the uh, two by two ceramic or porcelain price. We have some price band limit up to uh, 45 rupees or 55 rupees. When we give pricing, it will be we'll be mentioning after what pile, uh, tile price band we have taken and we'll give the client of option of choosing the tile. Uh, so according to that, it will be happening. And uh, the tile price is including of labor and all everything that one. Uh, then next comes the plumbing. So plumbing will use the Ashirwad or uh, True Flow or something which is very good quality. We'll use it. Our Birla pipes uh, will use that, and the accessories will use the stainless uh, steel SS accessories. Will use it, and uh, this hardware like uh, uh, commode which comes with a tank will give that. Sinks will be there. Generally, we prefer for the ferry wear. If not, client is specific about the other brands that can be added as per the uh, client's requirement so we have done we are done with the steel structure then internal external walls uh, then roofing we are done then electrical uh, then plumbing is done and also tile is done now comes to the doors is done and windows is done now comes uh, to the uh, this waterproofing so in waterproofing uh, we will use some specific uh, material called as the paintable membrane manufactured by one of the company which is a tested material so out of all the materials we have been using it from the last 15 years this is effective uh, when we are using in the panel joints and also it is helping us uh, in any arresting any kind of leakage and we will give the validation to the client and we will uh, show uh, them if there is any leakage or not. If there is any leakage, uh, then we will rectify it again. And also, till the time there is no leakage from the uh, uh, the wall panels of the roof, we'll do that uh, waterproofing. So waterproofing, we are very well uh, positioned in waterproofing because we have a person who has got 30 years of experience and also we'll give the waterproofing assurance and guarantee based on our material what we are using it so this is the waterproofing part and now coming to the uh, uh, the our services availability and guarantees uh, certificates licenses uh, then a lot of a lot of people they ask about the uh, pricing mainly whether it is uh, lesser when it compares to the rcc or not or why it is higher than the rcc something that kind of queries every time we'll get it uh, let me explain you if the area is small less than 2000 square feet there will not be any pricing difference between the rcc traditional construction and the construction type what i have mentioned if about 2000 square feet is there and also the plans which is a normal plan uh, which we will generally construct if it is there then there will be a pricing difference of 10 to 15 percentage again depending upon the uh, location where we are serving so that is why we will give the plan specific pricing uh, what is the wall area wall area per square feet etc we'll give the plan specific pricing so whenever uh, and why it is advisable is the prefab a construction is advisable only to the clients those who understand the technology those who understand the um, you know the feasibility time importance only in that cases only this will work out so this will this will not work out for a layman uh, and people they generally think that uh, rcc constructions uh, even if it is costly of uh, 15 to 20 percent they will prefer to go for the rcc only 
um, because of the stability or duration whatever they they feel and their perception is so what the current project which we are doing at the g plus one at godiwada is an example the client uh, he himself researched uh, and he he got to know all the pros of the project the type of technology what we are doing and approached us to get the things done because uh, turnkey service providing in prefab construction is a challenge and uh, to find a reliable service partner turnkey partner is also uh, very difficult and the most advantage was the client is in need of the house to be completed within a very short period of time so then this kind of uh, technology will help uh, you know uh, to uh, get these things uh, done very fastly this can be used in schools colleges hospitals residential commercial complexes internal partitions uh, then hostels uh, penthouses farm houses security rooms office accommodations uh, staff accommodations washroom partitions any kind of donation uh, this thing the work can be completed at a fast pace uh, without any hassle and this again has the um, option of relocating the uh, materials of the steel and the wall panels uh, again this can be reused so many other advantages are there based on the the client's requirement their understandability and uh, you know uh, there are a lot of requirements are there and the geographical location where we are providing the service also matters so this session i am making it only to clear you know uh, to those who are approaching me in asking the pricings and all that so i am making a video for that purpose i have a lot of 800 and plus videos with each specific uh, uh, point pain problem is there and most of the sites which i have done are challenging sites only just to uh, understand the pain problem uh, of what all every uh, middle class person is going through so this this uh, might not be suitable for those who have financially those who are financially sound or those who understand the uh, you know the technicalities uh, and also this kind of constructions are sustainable and also will help in reducing the pollution so that's all for today and if you have any kind of query please have a plan ready uh, then I'll, I'll, I am trying to uh, put one standardization pricing uh, for all the locations which I will be preparing in the coming uh, days and then we'll share you uh, a pricing so that you can you yourself can uh, prepare the quote and understand how much it is going to cost. Thank you so much. Have a nice day.